Capricorn. Hi. How are you doing today, Capricorn? Hmm. And like I always say, Capricorn, if you're feeling alone right now, you are not, okay? You are not. Now let's get into your reading, Capricorn. Let's get into it. Let's see. Oh, don't forget, Capricorn. I'm having reading specials going on with my personal readings. All readings are $75. All you have to do is add my Facebook page at Leo's Tarot. If you don't see that sunflower and that lion there, Capricorn, that is not me. All readings are on special now, Capricorn, for $75, a deal of a lifetime. You get a love reading, a general reading, a specific question that you need answers to now. See what your angels want you to know. See what someone have been hiding from you. See what is coming towards you. All for $75, a deal of a lifetime, Capricorn. Get it now. Now, let's see. For the person that's on Capricorn's mind, what are their feelings and emotions towards Capricorn? They're sad. They're sad they're not giving to this. Okay. So, Capricorn, you're dealing with someone who's very sad that they're not giving to the connection or they're not getting out something that they wanted. They wanted something out of this connection and they're regretting it. With the Page of Pentacles here, it's like they want to get something off the ground with you, but they don't have much to offer you. They are holding back, okay? Could be due to a third party or someone that they was already connected with before they before you, okay? With the King of Swords being here, Capricorn, this is someone who very, they make head over heart decisions. They don't really think with their emotions. If they are in love with you, they will not think that, like, they will not move in that way, okay? With the Two of Wands, here this person is at a cross world they're trying to see what they really want but i feel like you make them very happy that's why they're very conflicted okay very sad why well, is the five of cups here for the person that is on capricorn's mind their feelings and emotions okay so we have clarifying the five of cups we have the Wheel of Fortune here, so things are about to change and look up. I feel like it's going to require patience and balance, okay? I feel like um, both of you guys are too intense, focused on this connection and not, um, not enough on each other. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Yeah. Yeah, this person could be focusing on work with the Eight of Pentacles here. They feel like they don't have that much to offer you. I mean, I don't want to call nobody broke, but I feel like they ain't really got no money to give you, Capricorn. They trying to manifest money for themselves, okay? Why is the um, strength card here? The Two of Cups. The Two of Cups. They're holding back from this connection, which is weird because, I mean, they feel a very strong bond towards you. Like, I feel like you stand out, Capricorn. You're very... I don't know. You're different. They really want to pour into this, but they're not saying anything. They want you could want communication from this person, Capricorn, but they're not saying anything. They need them. Why is the Three of Cups here? Why is the Three of Cups here? The Death card and the Lovers. I feel like they're ending some type of third party that they was in and coming towards you, towards you. Capricorn. This is your twin flame. It's looking like it. This person feel very stuck when it comes to you. I feel like um. They feel a very strong bond with you that they never feel with anyone else. And it's kind of making them trapped in their head. They don't like that feeling. Why is the ace, why is the king of swords here? The queen of pentacles. And so this person finds you to be very nurturing, very grounded. I feel like it's a burden on this person. They know how special you are. And it's kind of making them be feel bad that they're being like cold and rude towards you or something but i feel like they are finna offer you a, be a new beginning but this person got a lot of fear coming around coming with them okay a lot of deep emotions they have towards you too that they're not expressing why is the two of wands here why is the two of wands here yeah, the page of swords. You you will receive communication with this person. If communication was stagnant, it's because they was dealing with someone in their past. And they now have moved away from that person because they just went through a tire moment with them, okay? Why is the sun card here? Why is the sun card here? The justice card. Yeah, Capricorn, you're going to get what you want out of this connection. This person wants things to be fair between you two, but they are healing. For, they just went through a tire moment, okay? Yeah, the Three of Swords. The Three of Swords, they just went through a tire moment. This person has been hurt. They is wounded right now. If they come towards you, this is why it requires patience. Because if they decide to come towards you, they could possibly hurt you because they are still hurting you. Let's see. What is this person's true intentions towards Capricorn? What are their true and honest intentions, Spirit? Ooh, I don't like this. We'll see. 
Okay, we have the Knight of Pentacles here. So this is someone who want to be in and out of your life. This is someone who's not looking for a real commitment. They just want to have a good time. With the Wheel of Fortune here, Spirit is saying something is going to change, however. But for it to change, you will need patience, okay? I feel like because this person needs healing, you could possibly too, Capricorn. With the Eight of Pentacles here, this is someone who's working on their finance because they just went through a tower moment. The obstacle is, is this tower moment that this person just went to, through. And I feel like they don't got no money. They ain't got nothing to offer you, even though they are divine masculine, okay? But they just went through something that really hurt them and really set them back financially. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Why is the Knight of Wands here? Yeah, yeah the six of cups they just went through some type of um breakthrough with them and someone else in their past and i feel like they got the butt end of the situation you know they're really carrying a lot of burdens i feel like this person is trying to figure out how they're going to pay this or that or something is going on why is the wheel of fortune here yeah the wheel of fortune is something's going to shift okay your person is trying to heal capricorn the three of swords and this is what's making them overwhelmed with feelings because they have a lot of feelings towards you for some you could be dealing with the cancer but they really want to come towards you they really do want to move towards you capricorn but things are stagnant they're not going anywhere because this three of swords is here this is an obstacle for you guys why is the temperance card here the chariot yeah, definitely some y'all could be dealing with the cancer came out again they want success and victory with you and i do feel like this is going to be a very beautiful connection it really is once you guys get over this patience i feel like neither one of you have patience i feel like your person kind of do but i feel like you're very anxious capricorn why is the um eight of pentacles here or your person could be very anxious and you got patience but i feel like your person is wounded clarifying the eight of pentacles here i feel like if your person have been having financial difficulties they will recover from it but i feel like they're making you feel rejected like they don't want you but really it's just financial problems that they're going through this is an obstacle for you guys watch the tower card here yeah the three of wands the three of wands in the empress card i feel like oof I don't know. They could have went, went through something like they was in a third party. Someone was cheating on them. You know, they really didn't have that much money to give to the situation or they was with someone who was draining their pockets for dear life, okay? And they could have had this tire moment with the ex-wife or a baby's mother, okay? And I feel like that's why they don't have time to give to you, okay? They really don't. I feel like this person, this is someone who wants to give to you but truly just can't. Just literally, they just they have nothing <laughs> like the only thing i mean they have nothing okay let's get some more out here what would be the um what is going to happen in this connection will it end in commitment spirit both of y'all need to get out y'all head both of y'all are in y'all head okay the eight of swords here both of y'all are up in your head this person is holding back okay both of y'all is overthinking literally thinking the worst okay with the nine of pentacles here spirit is saying that right now it's going to be stagnant you're still going to remain single capricorn even though the person is highly attracted to you you're still going to remain single why the eight of swords here for what's going to end up in this connection yeah capricorn get out of your head get out of your head the eight of swords and the five of cups it's making you very depressed bringing your energy down okay i feel like you feel like you missed on a good opportunity with someone but i feel like you're being naive you have not missed out on any opportunity your person is hurting in their growth okay why is the um scrunch card here yeah the two of swords clarifying the scrunch card is the two of swords both of you guys are in your head capricorn it's like you know this person loves you but then you know they're overthinking the situation and that causes you to overthink okay why is the five of wands here yeah the five of wands clarified by the queen of pentacles capricorn spirit wants you to focus more on your money stop spying on this person stop watching tarot readings okay why is the um nine of pentacles here yeah you could be watching like too many tarot readings and it's kind of confusing you or something focus more on your money with the um nine of pentacles clarify the nine of pentacles the high priestess and the four of swords so spirit is basically trying to tell you it's something that you're not listening to your intuition about it's something that this person triggering you that you need to heal from as well okay you need to look at it capricorn why is the uh, queen of wands here yeah 
clarifying the Queen of Wands here. It's the Justice card and the Ten of Swords. Capricorn, I, I feel like you still got some healing to do, even though you want things to be fair. You don't really want to obsess over this person, but you can't help it because the bun is just so strong between you two. The connection is literally pulling you, <laughs> dragging you at this point, Capricorn. You're like, I can't help it. I understand. It's powerful. I love you so much, Capricorn, but get out of your head. I feel like this person makes you insecure and make you feel rejected, and that's not the case. Okay, I love you so much, Capricorn. If you want a personal reading from me, all you have to do is add my Facebook page at Leo's Tarot. You will receive your personal reading through Messenger after you submit your payment. All readings are $75, Capricorn. You get a love reading, a general reading, a specific question that you need answers to now. See what your angels want you to know. See what someone have been hiding from you. See what is coming towards you. All for $75, Capricorn. A deal of a lifetime. Get it now. I love you so much, Capricorn. You are loved. Bye.